the Iguana Man Jr. right here. What's up, bud? What's up, what's up? Iguana hunting, South Florida. Hey. They're everywhere. Big one right there. Big one right there by that grill. I think you take that one out right there. Or maybe come high, come high. Actually, come high. Let him go by the water. Yeah, let him go by the water. Perfect. Here, follow me, follow me. Follow me. Look at the size of that dinosaur. Is that somebody's pet? We're gonna try to beat this iguana to his spot. A silly iguana. <laughs> oh. Let some line go. Oh yeah, yep, yep. Ooh. Ooh. -hoo -hoo. Nah, I'm just kidding, man. You got him, bro. <laughs> In the bag. <laughs> nice. Hey, good work, man. You keep this up, I might give you a job one of these days, maybe. I'll be looking forward to it. You gotta keep it up, though, man. Nice iguana, though. All right. Really nice. Let's bag and tag. Awesome. I'll I'll take care of him. Set that pole up. Let's go see if we can get another iguana. All right, y'all. We took out the alpha, and I think we found one of his females. Like I said, I'm just training this kid right here. He thinks he has what it takes to be an iguana hunter. What are you doing? You're passing the iguana, dude. He's over here basking in his glory because he caught an alpha. Let's see if he can do it again. It's like playing a carnival game, you know? Can you put the string on the head? Oh, my goodness. How did nope. I miss that? How on earth did I miss that? Yep, you're going to need some more practice, man, if you want to come out in the fleet, all right? For sure, for sure. A lot right more now, doing a training session. Yeah. I got to earn my stripes somehow, you know? So I got to go on a man teaching me how to earn these stripes out here. Hey, ain't nothing wrong with it, man. You're gonna, you're gonna miss some, you're gonna get some, but you just gotta keep on catching, you know? That's right. I just gotta put the time in, get my badge. All right, guys. Okay, so first of all, Roddy, we're rigging up. So I'm just, uh, just came here, there's a crab. We don't know what this crab's doing here. Honestly, he was just here, but it looks like a female and she's still alive, so we're gonna go ahead and flip her away back into the water. See, she's trying to swim. I know, mama. She probably came out. All right, there she goes. We just saved the crab's life. Incredible, guys. We're gonna see if we can get a fish or two. We're, We're at the secret jetty spot, throwing the NLBN three inch, uh, greenback colorway, ultralight setup. Let's go, let's get him. Oh, bro, I'm getting hit. <laughs> yo, John, on the NLBM, yo. I told you I was gonna thump by something. You did say something was thumping it. I thought it was a rock, but apparently that ain't no rock, sir. <laughs> yes, sir. Beautiful snook, saltwater snook. He's a fatty too, bro. He is. He's feisty too. Wow, man. Well, let me get him under control. Real quick. What is he? About twenty inches, maybe? Yeah. Yep. Yeah, get him under control. Let's get a quick photo. Let's oh, get him back swimming. Let me go right there. Baby snook on the NLBN. You wanna give him a kiss? Inch. Give him a kiss and put him back. There we go. All right, buddy. All right, man. Thanks for the tug. Yeah. You're on. I'm right now. Oh, big snook. Oh, wow. Oh, back to back snooks. Oh. Nice, back to back snook on the NOBN. Ultra light tackle. Come take a closer look at him. Right there, choked it. Perfect oh, hook I set. Mean, you got him right on the top lip. Nice, this is a beautiful snook right here. You know it's a snook from that black line right there? Yeah. Going straight down. That's actually how they sense bait and prey. Really? Yeah, they use that to basically sense it. So it's kind of like a shark. It's got like a sensory organ on the side of it. Exactly. Look at his eyes, they're kind of glowing, so I'm guessing he's a nocturnal feeder. Well, we Absolutely. did catch him at night, too. Yeah, complete uh, Yeah, complete nighttime, and look at the mouth, too. Take a look at this. Ultra big mouth. Very, very fine teeth. They have like a sandpaper type mouth. Um, 
they love little bait forages just like this imitation bait that I'm doing right here by NLBN. Highly recommend using them. Oh nice. And this snook is definitely about a good 24, 25, 25 inches. Alright, there we go. Nice healthy snook. Beautiful specimen. We're gonna go ahead. Absolutely beautiful snook. Um, basically they're super acrobatic. They jump in attempt to throw the hook. But once you have a solid hook set on them, they're not gonna go anywhere. Yeah, look at that tail too. It's got a little yellow on it. It's like a paddle, bro. Designed for power, speed, agility. Super quick and they hang around the structures right here where I caught it, right by the rocks. So they uh, go in and out the rocks and that way they could basically eat. Ambush the prey, exactly. Awesome, dude. Beautiful well, snook. Nice, you got him, bud. Yes, sir. That's some good eats right there. Thank you. God bless you, John. Wish I put it. Yeah, don't run the bag. Nice. That's about a 12 inch right there. It's going to make a nice mangrove sandwich. Ain't that right, Roddy? That's right. Oh, man. First keeper, guys. We, the other fish we caught, they were snook and they were undersized. So we had to release those. But these snapper, they got to be 10 inches to keep. And that's about 12 inches right there. So let's uh, change tactics. We already got our snook. Let's see if we can get some snappers, bro. You got to start looking the right way. That's a healthy boy right there, John. They're all healthy. Look at that right there. Mangrove snapper. One of the finest eating fish inshore and offshore. It's another another uh, 12, 13 inch. Roddy right here, this is my brother. He's actually about to rig up. He's gonna see if he can get on some action too. We just came out here for a nice little just hangout day. You know, nothing crazy. We've been working all day, everybody. John, myself, Roddy. You know, you just got to come out one time, you know, get some fresh air and kind of, you know, have some fun. That's what it's all about, guys. All right, we're ready to rock and roll. How you doing, boss? Yeah, I had an accident out here. Oh, uh, we didn't, know. No. No, no accident, no boat here? Not, not from us, no. No, not over here. No. Oh, shit. Mm, Probably on the north side, but right not here. No. Nah, there was no. We were, no, we were no. here. We were here for like an hour. We didn't hear nothing or see anything. So guys, wish us luck, guys. The police are here, or wish them luck, guys. The people that got hit or whatever, or the police, the rescue team. Wish everybody luck. The people that boats got hit and the rescue team. Uh, you know, looking for these guys, but uh, I don't know. Another one lost to the oceans, man.